Welcome back. <sighs> oh. Thanks for having Betra's back. I know you're there for her, which means she can be there for me. Huh. You're welcome. What if I go here? <clears throat> okay, what happens if I just go here? I'm freaking scared. Ryder, we're getting a lot of Capcom chatter. Keep a stealth, Callow. No sense picking a fight just yet. Yep. Angaran mining colony. Huh, snow? What the heck? Doesn't even look like snow. Looks like sand. A huge mineral deposit. Oops. Accident. up something. See it. Probes launched. Satellite detected. Appears to be posturing launch from the Solarian arc. Accidentally. Huh. Interesting.
What the heck, dude? You know what? I'm doing this first. The Archon ship appears to be operating, blah, blah, blah. can barely read it. So, arc parallels on semi. We need to rescue this arc. Screw it, we're doing this. I don't care. Let's do this. Hmm. Would it be, okay, this is a Salarian arc. Sh would it be best to <laughs> have Drac here? Now you know what? Let's let's change the Salari the Salarians' minds on Krogan. Besides, they follow me. Okay, a human. We found the Salarian arc. Apparently. Same tactical. It looks like the Archon captured it. The ships are tethered. What can we do? I'm working on it. Sam, connect me to the Moshai. On screen. Ryder, it's good to see you again. We've located the Archon's ship. It's more complicated than we thought, so I wanted to make sure we knew what we were looking for. It was a large remnant relic depicting Meridian. It's in his private chamber. His sanctum, he called it. Sanctum? Sanctum Sanctorum? He's very <laughs> proud of that relic. Good to know. That's what we needed. I appreciate it. And I appreciate what you're doing for all of us. But be careful. Of course. I've seen the Archon's cruelty. I hope you don't. That makes two of us. Thank Roger you for your that. help, Moshai. Of course. I wish you well. Okay, we play this right. Not only do we get away with the relic, we save the Solarians. I say we get onto the Ark, assess right. the situation, then sneak onto the catch ship through the tether. A feasible approach. Currently, Art Pachero is on standby. Only its stasis facilities are online. What about the Salarians? Unknown. Hmm. You heard the Moshai. The Archon hurts people. It's all he does. Then we keep our eyes open. We underestimate the Archon. We're dead. Ryder? He has family, huh? Whatever or... you need. Those are my people. We'll get them back. Now let's make this one count. Don't make promises you can't you can't keep. <laughs> yeah, this is priority, so even though I never do priorities first, I do them last. <laughs> because of side missions. Urgent alien vessels are detected within the system. Crud. Tempest were in. So far, no unusual activity from the catch ship. Let's hope it stays that way. Pathfinder, if you access a terminal, I can assess the situation. Roger that. Loot. Anybody? Hello? Accessing Arc Pachero's internal systems. A moment. Additional data encryption has been added. That's not regulation. Did the Solarians do that? It appears so. It's a cryptography key associated with their intelligence services. I have unlocked it. At present, Arc Parchero has arrived in the Helios Cluster. Location of Nexus is unknown. This is Captain Hager of Arc Parchero. If you are receiving this message, hostile aliens have captured our ship. Please look for our Pathfinder, Seven Raker. Situation urgent. Hmm. How long have they been here? We need to find them. Overriding the Pathfinder is responsible for exploring and assessing new worlds for outpost placement and settlement. This is Captain Hager of Ark Patero. If you are receiving this message, hostile aliens have captured our ship. Please look for our Pathfinder, Seven Raker. Situation urgent. The Andromeda Initiative encompasses all colonization efforts, including ARCs, Pathfinders, Outposts, oh. and the central support hub, the Nexus. This is Captain Hager of Arc Patero. Of course. If you are receiving this message, hostile aliens have captured our ship. Please look for our Pathfinder, Seven Raker. Situation urgent. But I just wonder how long the ship has been captured. Crud, dude. 
Okay, let's go. What the heck, dude? Uh, there's still some Cairo. Some tech infrastructure has been added, but the arc systems are operational. Hmm. So it's flight ready? Yes. Good. Are you thinking of? Easiest way to save everyone is to take the whole arc with us. Yep. Easy. Huh? <laughs> <If the right laughs> Done this before. Board, this might work. Hmm. No signs of fighting or struggle. Damn, Salarians didn't even put up a fight. Let's hope their Pathfinder can make sense of it. Right? It appears the cat have been offloading parts and equipment from the Ark. No good will come of that. Crud. What do their records say about the Solarian Sam? The patient is deceased. He is identified as Pathfinder 7. Cried! Shit. The guy we're looking for. We can't catch a break. We're still more fortunate than him. However, initiative records indicate Pathfinder Raker is female. This patient is male. What? What? And who is this really? Unknown. If you scan him, I can obtain a DNA signature. Oh my gosh. DNA signature obtained. If you locate a sequencer, I can confirm his identity. By agreement of the ARC senior leadership, sees all defensive operations against the alien vessels. Risk of catastrophe, catastrophic damage to the ARC and the colonists is too high. Huh. Interesting. They didn't want to endanger colonists. Who knows what happened? He probably surrendered. The DNA of the deceased Solarian matches colonist Jax Arlen. So they switched them, trying to hide their pathfinder. Oh. Let's check this colonist stasis pod. See if anyone. Okay. Can. I've marked the pod row. Typical Solarians <laughs> or smoke and mirrors. That's really clever, actually. I did the same. She crud. Like, if you can't fight straight up like Krogans or Turians, like, use your intellect, dude. I'd like to think they got away before the cat showed up. Captain but um, suggests otherwise. Yep. Aha. This isn't Jax Arlen's pod. What? Why'd you? Oh. This isn't the pot we're looking for. <laughs> this isn't the pot we're looking for. This is the deceased Solarian's pod. Yet I detect a female Solarian inside. I think huh? Another Pathfinder. Let's get her out. You need to access stasis controls to revive her. That's interesting. Oh, well, at least she's alive. Crud, man. Like two Pathfinders are dead already. Two original. I hope we're keeping guard. No need. <laughs> I'm fine. Solarian stasis recovery is almost immediate. Huh. <laughs> Who are you? Ryder. Pathfinder for the human arc. Where's Alec? Ha! <laughs> Immediately. He... Didn't make it. Didn't make it. Yeah, the Pathfinders probably knew each other. 
madness. Stasis was a mistake. I should never have agreed to it. Well, you have a 40 year lifespan, so you wouldn't have made it. What's bothering you? A leader leads. She doesn't go to sleep. Hmm. A hostile species, an armada, set upon us. Our captain saw no choice but surrender. Said we'd live to fight another day. And that day is now. They convinced me to hide in the general population and to dismantle my SAM so we wouldn't fall into enemy hands. But we're still Clever. in grasp, I see. Yep. We have come to liberate you. We're heading into the cat vessel to gather intelligence. Wake up a flight crew and ready the Ark for escape. On my signal. That'll be no trouble. And then I'll work on freeing the Ark, so you can focus on your objective. Well, I'm having my helmet on just in case. Do what you can, but stay quiet. We don't want to alert the enemy. Yes, yes, of course. I'm keying you into our comms. We'll stay in touch. Yeah, this mission got more complicated. Ah, a Sam in my head again. I'm back in the game. <laughs> we'll be ready, Ryder. Yeah, female Solarians sound. Yeah, what's that? In the tether. Going to cross to the catch ship now. Oh wow! Never mind. Okay, there's. So I guess there no are no indications. They're aware of your presence. Good luck, Pathfinder. Crud. Oh, they probably have prisoners here. Well, I have a helmet on, just in case something happens, like, you know, just in case there's a hole in the wall or something. You know, just in case. It's quick and quiet and they'll never notice. I think they noticed. Yeah, they did. Time to wreck. Oh, look. We walked right into that one. Yeah, we did. Keep the high ground. So much for sneaking in. What do we do now? If you locate a terminal, I may be able to analyze their systems. That's probably the spawn point. Loot. Accessing the ship's systems now. I have located the Archon's private chamber. Is the Archon in his quarters? That information is not accessible. Only the room's location. Roger that. What's their security situation look like? An alert was issued, but I have countermanded it. The delay is only temporary. Right. We need to hurry. Moshe said the relic would be in his chamber. Let's get there. Ryder. I thought you were on the Ark. Too many of our people are missing. If we don't find them now, we never will. Whoa! This is Hager, captain of our Ark. We'll focus on the rescue while you push ahead. A secondary route is available, marking nav point. We'll help you get on your way. I did not see these guys. Let's move. But I'm a history teacher. I don't know how to fight. Rider, if you <laughs> I've never done is I've never the door. That doesn't mean I just roll over and die. We can do this. <laughs> Captain Hager is right. Our people need us. We have to answer the call. I used to repair FTL Please don't die. Cash. I could probably rig up some surprises for the cat. Good. We have to be clever, improvise, and stick to the shadows. Yeah. Please don't die. Like, we'll we need, we need Pathfinders. I'm sorry we can't help you. We have our own mission. Good luck, Pathfinder. You too, Pathfinder. Yeah. Okay, Sam. The relic. I Still thought we were going there. It. Marking the route to the Archon's chamber. You may proceed. Hmm. It's not that simple. Only three of us and a ship full of cat. Four of us. I can't double. Huh. Huh. <laughs> Too busy there. there. Tables. 
seats. Yes, She's thank one you. Of the wisest people I know. We can oh, really? trust her judgment. I'll take your word for it. Same way. That's back to the hangar place. That's messed up. Confusion among the colonists. Maybe. Actually, the Pathfinder is still here. Are those guns out there? Confirmed. The offensive armaments of a highly capable warrior. Crud. Pointed at the Salarian Ark. That's going to be a problem. Your route continues on the far side of the room. I smell ambush. If those guns go off, you can forget about finding your relic. You can forget about everything. We need to shut off these guns somehow. At least it. Uh, I think there's gonna be an ambush. So you know. The cats sure don't mess around. They're out to get everyone, and if you can't stop them, you die or wind up exalted. Well, this room looks like it handles the dying part. We need to find a way to shut off these guns. I knew it. Shit, the door just locked. Ambush. I doubt that's an accident. Look sharp. Ambush, they're over there. Those tricky bastards, get ready. Got him. Yeah. We're locked in here. This looks 
ugly. We're not gonna last much longer. We won't last much longer! Ryder, we're here! We've got your back! It's the Salarian! Up top! We might just pull this off! Well, I can't we'll shoot that guy. Wow, I suck. Overwatch? Wow. I am such a bad shot. Captain Hager, we need suppressing fire at your 11 o'clock. Ryder, we need to pull out. We have wounded. Go. Go. We can take it from here. You saved Oops. our ass. Great, boss. Wounds were fatal. I'm sorry. He was brave. Crud. I can't access this terminal. It's not working. Ryder, can Sam open this door for us? Who's our dying old Stoker? A moment when I override security. Rekha, we've got a big problem. Did you see those guns back there? I know. They'll destroy the Ark before we can power up the engines. Unless... If you've got an idea, let's hear it. Venril here used to repair FDL drives on private cruisers. Venril, an EMP device? It might work. If we rig one to detonate near those guns, they lose power. And the Ark would be out of harm's way. What about your missing people? I'll keep looking. Captain Hadrian and Venril will focus on the EMP. Everyone be careful. Good luck. So the door is now open. Open. I'll stay in touch over the radio. In the meantime, we've got a relic to find. Sam? Marking the route to the Archon's chambers. Why are we still keeping our voices low? We are it infiltrating an enemy ship. Who already know we're here. <laughs> Why take chances? Heh. <laughs> Cracking jokes, really. No, I can't say during missions. Loot. We fail to rescue the Ark. How many Salarians will be left in Helios? Not enough. The whole species is at risk. They know what the Genophage felt like. Not now, Drac. <laughs> Hardening their security. Try scanning the access panel. 
The door is voice activated. I can attempt to modulate your vocal cords to approximate cat intonation. Okay. The system is asking for your authorization. How do you wish to respond? Crud, uh... Intruders have been spotted on the ship. We need to secure this area. Access closed. Of course it's disturbing. Well, time to go loud. Uh oh. Well, we're off the beaten path now. It kept loud. Nothing good can come of this. Skip these guys. He was just chasing them. Get science is about one thing. Inflicting suffering. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have shot them. Shit. That's kind of messed up what I did today. I'm sorry. Almost like they have something to hide. Watch out, Ken. They are dead. Be easier if the cat just handed the relic over. Nah, I prefer it this way. More dead cat. Stasis pods. I think we found all the missing stasis pods. All? Maybe the Salarians are still alive. The pod is empty. Damn. Also empty. They're all empty. What's going on here? Great. They might be they might be choosing them too. Shoot, dude. Might be turning them into cat. Crud. What's the point? What is this? Oh my gosh. Salarian is missing organs. It appears he died after the operation. They were alive while it happened? You! Do you hear me in there? I'm going to kill you myself! Bastard, you can't shoot! Hide. Crud, I can't do Enough. anything. Let's grab that relic and teach this archon bastard a lesson. That's messed up. You test on them while they're alive. They're sentient beings. They're not just some animals. Someone's going to pay for this. Get your anger out on them. It's kind of messed up. I kind of want to learn to forgive, but they need to put down their weapons that first. Felt good. Sam, how's it looking? The Archon's chamber will require a new path through the unlocked door. That was kind of messed up what I did to them, but hey, they were firing at me. Well, they were firing back, so.
Rider. Caution. Huh? Some kind of uh, immobilizing field. It's useless to struggle. You. I've been in this forsaken cluster for decades, surrounded by amoeba. Then you arrive, a human able to do the unthinkable. You even evaded me. Such an unlikely rival it was almost invigorating to have one. And yet, it's a fitting end. What are you going to do with me? Whatever I please. What? Hey, try that with me. Really? I have a freaking helmet on. A first sample. Your testing begins now. I what? will learn your secrets soon enough. EMP. Report. Await my arrival. Save your strength, human. Rika must have run into trouble. We have her beat. Sam, what can you tell me? I'm sensing a biological transmitter in your bloodstream now. Attempting to neutralize it. Okay, that's priority two for sure. Any idea how to break out of this? The containment fields only interact with living matter. If you expire, the field around you will extinguish until what? you reset. As you know, my access to your physiology allows me to enhance your vital signals when required. I can also do the opposite. <laughs> See? Whoa, oh my god. Kind of don't want to die today. After stopping your heart, I would attempt to resuscitate, of course. Uh... Are there any other options? No. None that I can determine. See? Do it. Alright. Let's do it. Ryder. Good luck. You better come back. Stop yeah, your heart. I better. Now. Oh! Stimulating the cardiovascular core. Zero activity. Oh my gosh. Stimulating the cardiovascular core. <sighs> That's twice now I've come back from the dead. Can't say really? the experience is improving. I believe it is preferable to the alternative. You two look comfortable. Down. Now. <laughs> Let's find a way out of this cage, huh? There is a maintenance corridor connecting to this room. Okay, must be a way to access it. I'll look for it. Might also want to poke around here while we can. Could be useful intel. Good little monster! Step away from there! What's that? What? Where are you from? A different galaxy. We call it the Milky Way. Why did you come? We're so do you hear just me? Looking now for a place you have to two leave. pathfinders to deal with, and we're not Where's impressed with your security. Force? We're not invaders. Please, who are you people? We don't mean any harm. Wait, wait, God! Ah! Crud. Rekha, come in. What's going on? I can't tell Another you, but I don't Captain know. Major and Venmo need time to stop you lie. Where is touched. the one you call Pathfinder? I don't know! <laughs> Curious, but one lie and that can be broken. You won't break something you can still use. Clever prattle. Everything serves. Before, maybe. 
But now, when I talk, you'll listen. Tell me what you know of Meridian. Is that why you're here? Meridian? I've never heard of it. We just got here. It was a long trip and... Again, tell me of Meridian. I just explained. I don't know what that is. I... Then what use are you? What do you... Dissect this specimen as you will. What a freaking... crud, dude. I'm known as Moshai. Here you are nothing. I am your enemy. You serve a use. That is all. That's why you still live. You will tell me what you know, or you will suffer. I told you! I've never seen the relic before! Pain will remind you. Ah! Oh. Oh. A final time. How does Meridian work? I don't know. Then the specimen will learn true agony. Man, what the heck is up with these cat, dude? The reports are true. Strangers have arrived on our borders. Specimen borders? Never seen. <laughs> We captured a lone vessel. The occupants claim they come from another galaxy. Milky Way, they call it. A great opportunity lies before us. A treasure of fresh specimens. Genetics shaped by forces outside our galaxy. This could be quite the prize. What the heck is he up to? Was this for science? You know you could just ask. One of the specimens, a human, has done the impossible. It spoke to the remnant machines. By some unknown power, it enforced its will on the old technology. The machines responded. The weather had changed. For years, we toiled in misery trying to understand it. And this newcomer succeeds in one day. At all costs, we must obtain this specimen. The implications for Meridian are... extraordinary. Crud, he has my blood sample. Because Sam helped out the AIs in my body and my bloodstream and all that. Crud. Jack has nothing to say about that. Whoa. Among the new specimens, the human is the most perplexing. Huh. It yeah. an emotional range which often exceeds the others. Oh, their yeah. unpredictable nature marks them as dangerous, but if the root of their passions could be isolated, we must identify a champion among them and capture what? them for further study. Champion, huh? The ones they call Asari. Their reproduction is a mixture of biology, thought, and remain. They take what they need from the species as they should. Reproduction cannot be left to chance. The superior race dominates. Yet these Asari pretend otherwise. A melding, they call it, embracing eternity. 
Apology has no use for poetry. In the end, their biotic traits may prove the most useful. Biotic, huh? These Turians possess a useful exoskeleton. On harsh worlds, it could prove advantageous. More intriguing, there is discipline about them, adherence to militaristic order. An effective trait for instilling obedience. Hmm. Yep. Additional specimens will be required for study. Most useful in these Solarians are their cognitive abilities. Their thought processes occur much faster than in the others. There is a cleverness about them, a cunning which could be leveraged. More work is needed to isolate the genetic markers. There is no shortage of specimens to choose from. We're just wasting time while Solarians die. Here we go, this way. Here's screams. We come all this way to find out the monsters in. Andromeda are just as evil as the ones back home. Of course. It's a messed up universe. That wasn't the chamber? Guess that was a lab. Part the main lab. Really? Must be one of my missing scouts. I can't tell which one. The 
DNA is broken, but drastically altered. They're trying to change them. Closing in on successfully exalting the species. Hmm. They're driven and efficient, that's for sure. They must pay. Oh, he told me. Maybe we should shut them down. Erase all their records. No, and that would piss them off and make them even work faster and be more aggressive. We made it. Captain Hager, this is Ryder. We've reached the Archon's Sanctum. Give the word and we'll set off the EMP. Should disable the guns. Got it. Alright guys, we're looking for a remnant relic. Map of Meridian. Why does this Archon care so much about the remnant? That's the question, right? isn't it? And we need to beat him to the answer. Remnant origin confirmed. Though it's not the relic we're searching for. Mm. The Archon's anger will only get worse if we pull this off. He needs to be stopped. What we've seen on this ship, it would be genocide for the whole cluster. The Archon has done extensive testing to this artifact, damaging it in the process. It is no longer useful. There's the Solarian Ark. This is going to be one hell of a getaway. Right? This object serves no useful purpose. It is the remnant equivalent of junk. The Archon is whistling in the dark on this stuff. Yeah, he is. And I bet this is it. Duh. Oh, another triangle. Like from the beginning of the game. This is the relic the Moshe described. It does seem to be a map. Shotgun. There's more to Meridian than you know. Changing the weather is a fraction of its power. And I will not allow you to defile it. Defile? The heck? They're like the Covenant, man. Like they worship the foreigners. I'm better equipped to handle it than you. Why? Because you have artificial intelligence in your head explaining it. I've seen what transpired in the laboratory. And now I know what makes you... Special. Meridian is mine. I've tolerated you long enough. Once your vessels are destroyed, you'll be stranded here. Captain, fire the EMP! Done! Lol. Let's go. Oh no. Boss fight. Can he have a shotgun? Dang, look at him. Looks pretty cool, actually. Kind of looks like Rhino from uh, Spider Man Marvel. Rack, anything you can do? Kroger, stand down! I don't think he understands. 
Stands! Kroger left! There! The Krogan's down! Sorry about that, Dragon. <sighs> Let's hope the Void will have him. Too so full. I'm picking up Krogan life signs on board the ship. Several captives are being held not far from your location. Crud. They are scheduled for exaltation. Okay, we need to rescue them. No one gets left behind. The rest of my missing skulls. Sam, do we have time to get there before the cat restore power? If you act quickly. Roger that. Ryder, it's Reka. I'm pinned down. Don't think I'm gonna make it. Crud! Where are you? Near holding cells where they're keeping several of my people. They're still alive. Ah! I can hate you back to the Ark. You should be with I couldn't leave my people. I had to try. And now, I think it's over. From one Pathfinder to another, farewell. Reka out. What? Damn it. There isn't time to save both. Once the cat restore power. Why can't we just send someone to help? Ah, I don't know what to choose! What is up with Mass Effect? It makes you choose between the Krogans or the Salarians. Gosh dang it, man. This game! Ugh! Oh, screw it! I'm saving the Pathfinder! Reload. We're going after Rekha. Drac, I'm sorry. <sighs> what are you doing here? Pathfinder, you came. Where's your people? Reka, we couldn't just leave you here. Thank you. My people are at the end of the tunnel. It's kept the whole way. Huh. Can we push ahead and don't stop for anything? Including Krogan. Drag. Wow. Don't worry. I'll shoot whatever needs shooting. Let's I'm go. sorry. Crud, man. Well, these guys... These... These Solarians are colonists or civilians. These scouts were already soldiers. We have to punch through! Tell them that... It's that or don't... <laughs> I hear you, Pathfinder. We have the map, and we're trying to rescue some prisoners. But those kit guns won't stay offline forever. I know, I know. Just tell us if anything changes. You'll be the first to know. Dang, you just ragged them in my shadow. Hello, out. What is this, uh, Taken from Destiny? Crud. They are throwing everything they have at us! We're fresh meat! They love the cut and open! Make a try! Jerk. I'm too busy collecting. I mean, protecting. <laughs> that was funny. Too much loot. Let's get them out of there. Yeah, I'm right here.
Can you run? Pathfinder, the cats are close to restoring the ship's power. Let's go. Tempest, we're going topside. Track for extraction. Understood. Ryder, thank you. Save it for when we're safe. <sighs> I'm depressed. Can't save everyone. The jump. Oh wow. Oh never mind. I thought you were gonna make a jump like right in their face. Go, 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 go. Hurry up. Couldn't save them all. A team will escort the Ark back to the Nexus. I'm sure they'll be happy to see you. Thank you again, Ryder. But I owe you an apology. I made a mistake. Oh? I shouldn't have called you to say goodbye. The choice you had to make. I put too much on your shoulders. You did what you had to. If that had been the Hyperion and I was looking for my people, I would have been the one calling you. I appreciate that. As Pathfinders, the line between serving our own people and the greater good is blurry. Yep. I prefer a sharper focus. I don't think there's going to be much of that in this line of work. I suppose not. Whatever the case, the Solarian people are forever in your debt. And thank you. <laughs> this. We will. <laughs> Drac. Wasn't enough to save the whole Ark, I uh, had to grab a few more Salarians on the way out. They're civilians. It's complicated, except it's not. Leaving my scouts behind was worse than killing them outright. And you're not the one who has to explain it to the rest of the clan. It was a difficult choice, Ryder, but you won an important victory. The Archon has been dealt a blow. Your father would be proud. It's been tough. Trying to fill his shoes. I hope I'm finally starting to earn it. Though slapping the Archon in the face like this will only make him more dangerous. <laughs> yeah, see? Less. Your father liked putting others off balance. It, maybe. He said the worthy would rise above it and learn to face adversity ably. And the unworthy? I'm very depressed right now. Would crumble. I'll leave you to your thoughts. <laughs> I'm really depressed. That is sad. Ah, he's pissed. With reference, Archon, this fascination with Meridian cannot continue. Hmm. It's the key to our future, Primus. The human knows nothing of its true power. Primus. Even we don't fully understand it. Our orders are to exalt this cluster. Hmm. Not study the remnant. Questions are being asked about you. Ha ha ha! The brass. Come from the highest levels. Yep, he's not the top. Archon's the not the top. Answers will be clear soon enough. With Meridian, we can transform every world in this cluster to a waste. Crud. Either the subjects submit to exaltation, or we will use it to annihilate them. This. Pathfinder has opened the door. Now we must be the first to cross the threshold. We must seize Meridian before it does. It? Like all lesser creatures, it mistakes a battle for the war. It doesn't know its weakness. Or its potential. Uh-oh. He has my memories, too. The Archon saw my memory flashes? He got that from my implant? 
His device went deep. Dang. Our connections were wide open when Sam killed you. We hit him once. We focus on doing it again. We have to rally the Nexus and move on Meridian. No, I still have a lot of crud to do. Strike team ready for deployment. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. That already sent people on missions. Thank you. Hey, Drek, I'm sorry. Now is not a good time to be talking to me, Pathfinder. <sighs> Listen. Why? Your actions told me everything I need to know. Now walk away and give me time to calm down before I do something you'll both regret. I'm sorry. sorry. I'm just... Sorry. Go. Uh, why can't I talk to her? Why can't I talk to her? This game. Wow. Hey, you're two for two. What do you mean? Two times face to face with the Archon. Two times you spit in said face. Figuratively speaking, of course. We were nose to nose this time. Some spit might have hit the mark. That's a two-way street, Ryder. Ugh. Us <laughs> is trying to exalt us all, huh? That's what all this is about? Could be. Typically, I like high-stakes games, but I'd rather be sitting at the kiddie table this time. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. He must like it in here. Bro. 
Ryder, what a victory. Now that we know where Meridian is, the Archon's downfall begins. Let's not celebrate just yet. This is just anticipation. You won't believe what celebration looks like. Let it out. <laughs> Angara believe that burying your feelings is a broken way to live. Interesting. I'll think about that. I'm free to talk more, now or later. I'll see you later, John. Stay strong and clear. We need to talk about Sam. Dr. Taparo does not approve of how we escaped the Ket containment field on the Archon's flagship. By stopping the Pathfinder's heart? No, I do not approve. We didn't have a choice. If there had been another option, I would have taken it. How can you be so calm about this? Ryder, Sam killed you. Yes, he brought you back, but what if he didn't? Hmm. I cannot learn without the Pathfinder. That would be akin to killing a part of myself. Your lines of code, you can't die. Hurting me goes against Sam's design. Because AI have never acted against their designs before. <laughs> <sighs> Look, I'm not against Sam. I'm not against you, Sam. But my Noted. job's hard enough without an AI stopping your heart. Even to save your life. Your concern is noted, Doctor. Of course it has. Lexi, I apologize for any distress I have caused you. And I'm sorry for calling you lines of code. <laughs> You're more than that. Even if you don't have cells to prove it. Need something? I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Got a minute? I could use a favor. Sure. What do you need? I kept thinking about Sarissa and my not being a Pathfinder. And the thinking turned into a project on EOS. Can you help me finish it? What kind of project? I'll put the nav points in the helm. Come along and I'll show you. Hope the Salarians find their place on the Nexus. We came to Andromeda because we had a contribution to make. The cat won't take that away. Where's Liam? I need a break. Do you need a break? Let's go for a break. Really? Care for some tea, Ryder? I'd love a cup. What? It's a cultivar originating in Sumatra. My own personal stash. Once I run out, 
That'll be it for Earth Tea. <laughs> I bet. I keep having these thoughts. I'm never gonna taste this again. I'm never gonna see that again. You're not the only one, Subi. I have those senseless thoughts all the damn time. And? Do they bother you? It's natural. You'd have to be made of stone not to miss home sometimes. The universe is like a giant tapestry. I love following its threads. But it distracts me from the whole picture. My family was right there. But I was too occupied by the abstract to appreciate them. From everything you've told me, you're here because of your family. Your love of science, doesn't that come from them? Aren't you with them every time you chase down a new discovery? Huh. Ryder, that's beautiful. My mother made the implant in my head, and my father created the AI that uses it. I haven't lost them either. Thank you, Ryder. Of course. Well, I say, oh, she just disappears. Feeling all right. You were clinically dead for a few seconds. I didn't even know a Sam could do that. I didn't either. Imagine how I felt. <laughs> I'll bet. Death is the only exit, not the most reassuring words to hear. Anyway, thank you, Sam, for saving Ryder's life. You're welcome, Dr. Admiral. I should get back to things. Sounds good. How's it going? I should get back to things. Sounds good. A real victory. Our Ark back at the Nexus. I'd almost given up hope. The Kelt won't touch the Parchero again. The militia will see to that. It's horrible to think of Salarians in Ket hands. But at least our Pathfinder made it. Thank you, Ryder. I mean it truly. If you ever need a favor, just ask. I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. What can I do for you? I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Hello, Puck. Hey. Are you okay? I shudder to think what the Archon meant to do with you. I heard you had to die to get out of a trap? I think of myself as daring and death-defying, but you? I did what I had to to get us out of there. You're made of strong stuff, Ryder. Just don't get yourself exalted, okay? That asshole means to catify us all. Can't let that happen. But he's close. He's almost figured out Krogan. It's the scariest thing. Ugh. Let's talk about something else, okay? Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. <laughs> Hi there. Just checking in. What's up? Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Strike team ready for deployment. Hello. Hey, Ryder. Thinking about our run through the Archon selection. Word you weren't even me. there. You die again. I'm taking it to HR as emotional abuse. Stop it. We'll talk later. I know it. Yes? We'll talk later. I know it. So, second. Second. He must like it in here.
difficult? I've seen you do things twice as complicated. Eh? I'll put together a crew in a heartbeat. But this is just beyond me. Just do it, or I'll find someone who will. You realize that even if I do find it, it's gonna cost you. And you know I'm always true to my word, so just get it done. I'm hearing the Ket activity's down. I bet the Archon's still nursing his wounds. That means he can be beaten. The Ket can be beaten. People are waking up to that. Didn't sound like you were discussing Ket over comms when I walked in, though. Wasn't. I have a friend keeping a lookout for a lamp. One brought from home, but stolen in the revolt. I didn't think you were so sentimental. No, what? I'm not the only one. Hello? Suvi has her father's Sorry, antique instruments. Cora, her Asari prayer book. And Liam has the junk that Liam collects. <laughs> These things are important. They remind us where we came from. Okay. I know what you mean. I never want to forget what I left behind. Even as we look forward to the future. Yes. So what's so special about this lamp? It's awful. It's got a butt naked Asari for the stand and she's holding a moon. What? One of your prized possessions is a really ugly lamp? Ugly. The foreman at my first job had this lamp. When he was mean, I'd focus on it so he wouldn't see me upset. Now I keep it so I remember where I started. Most of my life was doing stuff to survive, taking shit from assholes or being one. I don't have to do that anymore. I can start over. Something honest. What? Honest work? Vetra, you'd be an awful farmer. Yeah, you don't know that. Point is, I could be anything. For a while, I didn't care that I'd lost the lamp. Everything was a mess, and it just didn't matter. But we've made progress, Ryder. Small things matter again. People are daring to dream. It's nice seeing you like this. I know. I like being able to let go and do something for myself for once. Let's hope this is just the start, huh? I feel like things are finally going our way, for real. Getting the Solarians back, that's huge. Huge. We didn't have to sacrifice so many for it. Right? You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. <laughs> what? Ryder. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. to a nexus. I do like barrier, it's really good. Huh, that's interesting.
Even though I'm singing with Soldier. Should probably save. ships okay we should probably go Three of them, nice. Just need a Turian arc. about Kerry. Okay. Haki, Kerry's producer. I'm the one making you look stunning for the documentary. <laughs> Thank you. Unfortunately, Kerry was making the initiative sound too good for some colonists. They believed the hype, so when actual danger bit them in the ass, they blamed her. I can't get her to leave her apartment. Can you try talking to her? I'd hate for all her work to go to waste. Kerry's got a space on the commons. Even a hello might help.
Carrie? Ryder? Are they gone? There's no one here but me. They mobbed me. Colonists. They said my documentary made Helia sound too safe. I painted that rosy picture then. All the wolves out there chewed them up. Those were my words. You just captured them. No one would raise a hand against their dear Pathfinder. This is an easy target. True. So do what you do best. Grab your camera and show everyone what's happening. Like it's that easy. Although we have been missing a counterpoint to damn yeah. you, Ryder. Maybe things will settle down. <laughs> Just jump down. Where do you have this? Now, why would I want to wear this? Sit here. Hi. How are you and Vetra doing? I think we're good now. It's never going to be the same as before, but maybe that's okay. She sees me differently. Less someone to protect and more a partner. I like that. I'll let you get back to work. Waiting for you. Careful. <laughs> of course you approve. Ryder saved your people. Ryder saved our people. It doesn't matter if they were Salarians. They were citizens of the initiative. But it doesn't hurt if there's a few less Krogan around, does it? <sighs> <clears throat> the Pathfinder. Oh, really? Ryder, we were discussing how things ended with the Archon. Sorry. Kesh, it's true I had to leave some Krogan behind. I'm sorry about that. In this galaxy, I would hope every life matters. Even if it's just a few Krogan. Yet I have to question what we gained, provoking the Archon like this. He had a map showing the location of Meridian. Now we have it, and a short window to get there. It's the control center for the terraforming network. If we get that working, all our problems are solved. Based on what data? This is all alien science. The vault on Aya suggests that Meridian is the key. While I appreciate what you've done for our strike teams, we're not equipped for a war with the Cat. They'll be defending Meridian with everything they've got. This is how we beat them. The Archon doesn't know how to bring Meridian online. He can't control the technology. I can. Vaults, maybe. 
We don't know if Meridian works the same way. And attacking the Ket only to find out you're wrong? Then there's this Sam of yours. We took a chance letting AI get involved. Frankly, I'm uncomfortable with just how involved it's become. I can't support your plan, Ryder. Then I will. And so will I. Ryder deserves a chance to try. Wait, I where's the turn? You know what? I'm Which gonna load this, dude. I'm gonna reload this whole thing, dude. I'm not gonna do this yet. Because I want the Turians here. Eh. What's the matter, Tan? Don't want anyone else overshadowing you? It's not called the Pathfinder Initiative. The chain of command has to be respected. That is all. Why am I surprised? I don't exactly have a plan B. There may be a way. Pathfinder, apologies. There was an urgent message for you. They said your sister is awake. What? Go. We'll talk later in the tech lab. I want to find a Turian arc. I want to find a Turian arc before this. <laughs> Sarah. Why is she standing on the bed? What Man, the it's heck? Good to see you. It's good to see you. Oh my god! I was to think I'd this game! <laughs> Why? She should be sitting down on the bed. Okay, now she's well, better. I sure missed having you around. We've hit a few rough patches along the way. I'm sorry I wasn't there when Dad died. There's nothing anyone could have done. I wasn't even sure I should tell you. I'm glad he did. Gave me time to let it sink in. I'll miss him. But I also know he'd be the first to say... I have a, I have a get over longer it. head. <laughs> get on with it already. Oh, there's been plenty of that. So I hear, Mr. Pathfinder. Not by choice. From the sounds of it, you're going to need all the help you can get. Careful. No way are you fit for duty, miss. That stubborn skull of yours needs a chance to heal. Says who? Just for once, take it easy, will you? There'll still be plenty of mountains left to climb when you wake up. Oh, better leave the tallest one for me. Good night. <laughs> If you two want to catch up some more, that's fine, but no getting out of bed. I'm reloading. I am not doing this. <laughs> I want to have the Turian arc here first. Go to Sid. Talk to Sid first. Vetra doing? I think we're good now. It's never going to be the same as before, but maybe that's okay. She sees me differently. Less someone to protect and more a partner? I like that. That's good. I'll let you get back to work. Okay, let's find the Turian arc.
<laughs> We're just leaving. We're not going to the meeting. <laughs> meeting postponed. Gotta find a Turian arc. All systems green. Pathfinder, you have new email. Not really. <laughs> she didn't do something reckless, as far as I know. No, we're finding the Turian Arc first. Before start before starting that journey to Meridian. Crud. It's on that planet. Okay, we're strictly here for the Turian arc. We're on course. Wow, three moons. I didn't notice that before. I guess this is the most habitable moon. Because gas giants aren't really habitable, I believe. You know what? Maybe I should bring Drac. Why not? His planet. Sam, send Callow the nav point provided by our Krogan contact. Drac, we're landing on Eladin to rendezvous with Jorgal Strux. On my way. I think he's so pissed. Uh, I kind of had a feeling I shouldn't have done that uh, Archon mission right away. Oh well. Where is this meeting place exactly? Called the Paradise. Middle of nowhere as far as I can tell. Paradise is different for a Krogan. It... The heck? Remnant Starship? No. Interesting. Only forty-one percent exposed. I will gather what information I can, Pathfinder. Only forty-one percent? That's huge. Okay, let's find us Turian Arc. We're strictly here for that, and then we'll come back. <laughs> uh. And hopefully we could get that hug right. Great cutscene, so. Here besides the Krogan. Scavengers with nothing to lose. Criminals chucked out of Kadara. <laughs> Gonna be interesting. All the way over there, huh? Be careful. From what I hear, it's swarming with scum. Just make 
sure you know where your guns are. I detect above normal temperatures. Crud. Activating automated forward station deployment. Yeah, I don't know, should I take off my helmet? But, you know, to, uh, because it's freaking hot, but maybe I should, you know. So, Elodin. Charming so far. What do we got? Besides the sand. The Revenant monolith suggests this was indeed supposed to be a golden world. It yeah. also suggests the presence of a vault. Additionally, yep. here is the large derelict remnant ship that we saw as we landed. Hopefully abandoned? Scans indicate it is not. The site is active with scavengers and remnant bots. Here, scavengers have taken over an abandoned camp between the two. In this direction, located in one of the planet's sinkholes, is New Tuchanka, the Krogan colony. <laughs> New Tuchanka? Wow. Sounds fun. Not really. Elodin is tidily locked to its sister moon and that gas giant above. This side of the moon never cools. <laughs> Getting Jeez. trapped in a sinkhole without shelter would mean certain death as one's blood would boil in 75 seconds. Wow. And on that cheery note, let's head for the climate-controlled paradise of the Nomad. It... Let's go find us an arc. I detect above normal temperatures. See how these sinkholes, huh? Roger that. Extract minerals via your mining in Ryder, are those scavengers dismantling the remnant tech? Is that a problem? It is if they get their hands on a no. that's it. I just skip it. I should have gotten here first instead of that freaking mission, but it'll take like hours just to cl map, map clear. Because I remember the last planet I was on took like what, maybe six hours to clear that whole friggin' thing? Got so much crud to do. Oh, we're on sand dunes now. This place is a wasteland, dude. history. According to the final log, this stasis pod was jettisoned from Ark Natalis. Jettison? 
Maybe when it hit the scourge. The timeline doesn't match. This pod was ejected long after Natanis was reported missing. Hmm. These stasis pods were dumped for a reason. Pick one. Andromeda is nothing but dangerous. We should update Avitus. He'll want to know what we found. I think that's an architect. Yeah, see, there's so much crud here. Then look, we got side, mi some more side missions. Okay, we'll go back to Tempest. Where's the nomad? What the heck? Let's go. <laughs> really? Strike team ready for deployment. They're all over here. Pathfinder, you have pending vid calls. be coming from your SAM implant. He's sending me his location. We did find evidence that Natanis may be intact. What evidence? A bunch of stasis pods were... Yeah, this guy's from Havari. No survivors. But the logs show it happened long after Natanis hit the scourge. There's someone still flying the damn thing. Or keeping it afloat, at least. Here are the coordinates for my implant. Meet me there. We'll find answers. Save this, I prefer this one. <laughs> All the way over here, crud. Approaching the nav point provided by Avatus. Approaching the nav point provided by Avatus.
crud. That's it looks bad. The Turian Ark. It's seen better days. In right? Cool. <clears throat> Pathfinder, I think we're on the right track. No kidding. Is it safe to board? Only one way to find out. I'll meet you inside. Limited power. Life support's busted. Surprised there's any gravity at all. This can't be easy to see. I'm not really a feelings type of guy, Ryder. Even so, let's just find Mason. HO47C. It was supposed to be the Turian homeworld in Helios. Like Habitat 7. Whoever was piloting the Ark wanted to get here, no matter the cost. They wanted to find home. It's not really a home if no one's left to live there. Come on. Speculating won't get us anywhere. We're lucky this part of the Ark survived. Looks can be deceiving, Pathfinder. The hull is barely holding together. Thanks, Sam. Always a ray of sunshine. I could... ...provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. still got power. I wouldn't open that pathfinder. It leads to space. Perhaps you could yeah. divert the power to a different door. Power has been diverted, Pathfinder. This one's still good. Juice. Pretty busted. Think your Sam can get us in? Don't give the AI all the credit. I help. Excuse me. I found a log from Dea Preton, the Ark's captain. The video is corrupt, but I can recover the audio. Play it. Something's tearing the Tannis apart. Half the cryo chamber is gone. Trying to get anyone awake to the escape pods. Spirits, there's no time. Find Mason. Maybe she found him. Made it to the escape pods. He wouldn't leave the Ark without me. Natanis didn't get here on its own. We need to know what happened next. The rest of the data on this console is corrupt. Perhaps if we find another. All the Ark's Sam node. All right. Let's keep looking.
Mm. Wow. This one also needs power. Maybe we can use the same trick as last time? Divert power from something else? The door should now be operational, Pathfinder. Avidus, over here. There's still life in this one. Sam. Sam. How are we doing? Mason. Bring it back. The video's corrupted on this one, too. What about audio? Repairing now. One moment, please. We need to remain objective. Yeah, I've never been objective when it comes to Mason. Try. For his sake. Playing audio now. Sam. How far to Abby's pod? 300 meters. <laughs> An easy stroll then. Damn it! Or maybe not so easy. Where's the rest of it? That is all I could recover. Damn it. He was looking for your pod. Do you remember anything before waking up on Havarl? I told you. My first memory was clawing out of my stasis pod. Then we keep looking. leads to the SAM node. We've got to get in there. The SAM node should now be accessible. Whoa. Something's wrong. SAM, where's the Pathfinder? Where's Mason? Avi. 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 Commence. Stars. Avi. Isn't that what Mason called you? He's the only one who calls me that. My counterpart is suffering from severe trauma. If I partition the damage, it may be able to speak with us. Be careful. I don't want to lose this Sam because we rushed for answers. Avitas Riggs. Welcome home. Sam, Mason sent coordinates to this location. I need to find him. You are mistaken. I send the coordinates. Okay, this is officially getting weird. Next, you'll say you flew the Natanis here. I did. What? The Pathfinder ordered me to help Avatars find the Torians a home. Where's Mason? Gone. This thing's still busted. It doesn't know what it's talking about. We should have access to Mason's logs. Maybe there's something in there. <sighs> Abby, whatever we hit, a piece of it shredded my suit. Stings like hell, but spirits. It's beautiful. I need you to go on for the both of us. Don't let that temper get the better of you. Sam, commence transfer. Yes, Pathfinder. Even the stars look brighter. He died before the transfer was complete. That must be the source of Sam's trauma. Why bring me here? What was the point? To complete the transfer, the Torians need a Pathfinder. Hmm. <sighs> I, I can't. What do you mean you can't? I never thought I'd get the job. My whole career, I work alone. I don't know how to lead people. I don't want to lead people. Avatus, I've seen you protect settlers. You found the Turian Ark. You've already been playing the part of Pathfinder. Just without the title. A title that belongs to Mason. Which he wanted you to have. Rejecting it won't bring him back. Well, what if I let him down? You could only do that by walking away. <laughs> ah, True. Damn it, you're right. Shall I begin transfer? It'll be safer on the Nexus. Suvi, call Tan. We need a shuttle to pick up the Sam node. Tell him we found the Turian Pathfinder. What about the Ark? That's it?
Wow, that's it. All systems green. With a Turian arc. Lean team to recover the stasis pods from the arc. Natanis, for someone who hasn't keen to take the job, he's certainly enthusiastic now. If all goes well, we we'll save the lives of 15,000 Turians. No small achievement. Go to Nexus. Go say it. Oh, more systems open up with that. A lot more systems. So are we going to get the Turian arc back? Is it flyable? Fit. Yeah, it wasn't flyable. Look, see? It's not here. Okay, time to We headed out soon? More survivors. Great to see you. Names please? Gallian Lateris. Hi. This is <laughs> Your medical scans look good. Welcome. You can go through there. It's safe here. The app stations at I told you to, no pirates will reach us here.
They're waiting for you. Careful. Yeah. Of course you approve. Ryder saved your people. Ryder saved our people. It doesn't matter if they were Salarians. They were citizens of the Initiative. But it doesn't hurt if there's a few less Krogan around, does it? <clears throat> the Pathfinder. Ryder, we were discussing how things ended with the Archon. Yeah, I'm sorry about the Krogan. Kesh, it's true I had to leave some Krogan behind. I'm sorry about that. In this galaxy, I would hope every life matters. Dude, why does it sound like Even I have a helmet on? A few Krogan. Yet I have to question what we gained provoking the Archon like this. He had a map showing. Look! I, uh, oh my gosh, listen. Jeez. Now we this is horrible. And a short window to get there. It's the control center for the terraforming network. Ah, oh, the effect of last mission. Problems are solved. Based on what data? This is all alien science. The vault on Aya suggests that Meridian is the key. While I appreciate what you've done for our strike teams, we're not equipped for a war with the Cat. They'll be defending Meridian with everything they've got. This is how we beat them. The Archon doesn't know how to bring Meridian online. He can't control the technology. I can. Vaults, maybe. We don't know if Meridian works the same way. And attacking the Ket, only to find out you're wrong? Then there's this Sam of yours. We took a chance letting AI get involved. Frankly, I'm uncomfortable with just how involved it's become. I can't support your plan, Ryder. Then I will. And so will I. I agree. Yeah. Ryder deserves a chance to try. I applaud the gesture, but you answer to me. I hope you understand. What's the matter, Tan? Don't want anyone else overshadowing you? It's not called the Pathfinder Initiative. The chain of command has to be respected. True. That is all. Why am I surprised? I don't exactly have a plan B. There may be a way. Pathfinder, apologies. There was an urgent message for you. They said your sister is awake. What? Go. We'll talk later in the tech lab. Yeah, she's probably gonna. Well, the Solarian's probably only gonna talk because that's the only required mission before getting here. You didn't have to find the other arcs if you didn't want to. Sarah. Oh my gosh, I saw the helmet. Oh! Bring it here. Okay, finally. Finally, she's sitting correctly. And their heads just like. see anything. I was starting to think I'd never wake up. She's kind of dark. What the heck? Like I'm kind of dark too. Well, I sure missed having you around. We've hit a few rough patches along the way. I'm sorry I wasn't there when Dad died. There's nothing anyone could have done. I wasn't even sure I should tell you. I'm glad he did. Gave me time to let it sink in. I'll miss him. But I also know he'd be the first to say, get over it, get on with it. I was kind of hoping your sibling would join your squad. So I hear, Mr. Pathfinder. <laughs> Not by choice. From the sounds of it, you're going to need all the help you can get. Careful. No way are you fit for duty, miss. That stubborn skull of yours needs a chance to heal. Says who? Just for once, take it easy, will you? There'll still be plenty of mountains left to climb when you wake up. <sighs> Better leave the tallest one for me. If you two want to catch up some more, that's fine. But no getting out of bed. Okay, yeah, I was hope. As I was saying, I was hoping that. Uh, That your your sibling would join your squad in the game eventually. Right, but... this is Pathfinder Rix. We have some ideas about Meridian. Come by the tech lab as soon as possible. We'll do. Hey. You're probably wondering how things have been going. I still have a helmet on. Yeah, feeling a little out of it. I know you're Pathfinder, but not much else. 
This is bad. Did they make you president of the universe too? What? That. Well, the big vote is tomorrow, and I'm here to make sure every comatose patient has their say. Vote right. Ha ha. So what have you really been up to? In a nutshell, we found an alien terraforming network that spans the cluster. We're going to reactivate it at some place called Meridian. That sounds practice. Wow. That all? Nope. There's also a race of aliens called Ket that wants to turn all of us into them. And their leader, a guy named Archon, wants me dead. Well, it's not their leader, but uh, whatever. Right. Maybe taking a long nap wasn't so bad. You should know. Dad was keeping some secrets from us. How do you mean? First off, Sam's a lot smarter than he let on. Also, his connection to Dad, and now me, is way more powerful than the other Sam's. I never knew that. What was Dad up to? Dad encrypted memories in Sam. I've started unlocking them. What were they? You, me, and Mom. You saw her? In the hospital, the day she passed away. And at that reunion dinner, she twisted our arms on. Right. Awkward. And something else. Dad meeting with a benefactor back in the Milky Way. Some initiative power broker I'd never heard of. <laughs> me either. Weird. Yeah. Still trying to figure out what it all means. I thought maybe we could talk about mom and dad. What about them? Thought you might want to know how dad died. I've been wondering. First planet we landed on. There was an atmosphere processor. It was malfunctioning. Dad managed to power it down. Saved us all. But there was an accident. My helmet broke. I couldn't breathe. And then Dad gave me his. He sacrificed himself. Yep. It was hard to tell with Dad. He could be so distant. I guess he loved us more than we knew. All those times I yelled at him growing up. <laughs> you and me both. This is a better way to remember him. What? Yeah. Wait, was she talking? And what? <laughs> What do you remember about how they met? As mom tells it, he was doing his N7 training on Earth. She was a scientist working on biotic implants. He was trying real hard to pull off a bad boy in uniform thing. And failing. But she thought it was charming and struck up a conversation. Dad mostly just grunted. She finally had to ask him mm. out. <laughs> Our dad, the ladies' man. Then he went off to fight the first contact war. Yep. And that was over. We were born, and Dad was posted to the Citadel as an attaché. Hmm. What do you remember about Mom's biotic research? That was back when biotic abilities were a total mystery. She was a pioneer, helping people cope by designing implants. It's what made her sick, though. People got all sorts of weird diseases uh, from meso exposure. Yeah. What do you remember about growing up on the Citadel? Giant space city filled with every kind of alien you could imagine. I remember trying to play hide and seek with some Hanar. It was no fair because they could float. Looking back, it's probably why I'm here. I saw how mind-bogglingly enormous the universe really is. You still think about mom? When I woke up, I forgot she was dead for a second. I looked around for her. Then I remembered. Dad talked about her before we left on our first mission. He didn't show it, but he never stopped thinking about her. He wasn't the same after she was gone. At least they're together now. Feeling homesick at all? Well, all I've seen so far is this Met Bay. We could still be on Earth for all I know. But yeah, before we went into stasis, I was missing my life. Or at least, the idea of it. Well, which part do you miss most? Looking for Prothean artifacts. My team was a special exo-archaeology unit. Fully funded and sanctioned by the Alliance. My job, as in they paid me to do it, 
was to help dig up more artifacts and learn whatever we could from them. If things hadn't gone sour, it would have been a great life. What was wrong with how things really were? Well, Mom was gone. I'm not sure I'll ever fill the hole she left. And Dad, it hurt him more than he let on. Plus, his research on Sam was illegal as hell. He was trying to save her, and maybe the initiative looked the other way, but the Alliance didn't. I wonder if it's an After April Fool's joke. Him, whenever people found out <laughs> That'll be Iris's sad. Daughter, door slammed in my face. Being Alec Ryder's kids in the Milky Way, we were in for a lifetime of dreams that were never going to happen. <laughs> well, I should let you rest up. Yeah, only way to recover from a coma is getting more sleep. It won't be much longer. At least take some pictures of Meridian for me. I can pretend I was there. I'm glad to see you and your sister back together finally. I appreciate you looking out for Sarah. Your family's been through enough. It was time you had some good news. Though we need to keep her around for observation, give her time to recover. Oh. That's all, Harry. Thanks. I'll be here if you need. Kids go back to operations. Tech lab. No. Oh. At the docking bay. I'll handle any fallout. Nice. No, I can turn strike teams on these? I never knew that. <sighs> 10 mission funds. Bronze. Yeah, whatever. Four hours? Holy crud.
Yeah. <laughs> I got your report. Both our Pathfinder and the Natanis. What a mess. It could have been much worse. True. We've got survivors to find and a new Pathfinder out in the field. I'll take it. I owe you for this, Ryder. They'd still be lost without you. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. What the heck, man? I still have a... Whatever. We're getting the Solarian Arc settled in now. That's an entire wave of arcs accounted for thanks to you. Plus, outposts and... The how do you find time for all this? I could help you manage your time better. If you like. Like I have time for that. It Just so you know, our intel says the Archon's pissed. I'd warn your team. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Hi again. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Best to give my grandfather some space, Pathfinder. Nothing more for now. Later. Pathfinder. I'm sorry. I, I, I chose the civilians. Hashtag never Addison. Hashtag not my colonial affairs director. Hello. I wonder what my place here would look like. But it's better this way. Okay, just those planets, really? Well, we're not able to look at... We're not able to... To fix e uh, Habitat 7. The Asari seem happy just to be alive. But the Nexus is running out of places to put them. I know. The outposts can't come fast enough. What do we do in the meantime? Would they be willing to go back into stasis? After what they've been through? Ryder. I trust there are no hard feelings. As tempting as Meridian may be, caution must guide us. I can see where it's the safest course. Risk aversion may not sound inspiring, but when the lives of so many are at stake, oh. it's the right call. Did you have some other business? That's all. Thanks for your time. Of course. Unfortunate news about the Turian Ark. At least some survived. It could have been much worse. And I see we have a new Pathfinder. Avatus just needed a little coaxing. Surprising, considering he's a former Spectre. They had a reputation <laughs> for, shall we say, extreme measures. Yes, they do. Now that he's a Pathfinder, I'll expect him to temper his methods. Did you have some other business? That's all. Thanks for your time. I'm here to serve. Sound like I have a helmet, so... Something I can help you with? I should go. Marking a major diplomatic 
Never mind, nothing here. Okay, who brought back the cherry like fruit from Habitat 7? Whatever. I thought we get to go in there. Oh well. And I still have right, a helmet. Good to see you. We've been working with Dr. Aradana and her team on the problem of getting to Meridian. We think we have the answer. Uh, her coffee mug fell. Its plans for new technology we've designated Ghost Storm. What? When you approach Meridian, our own ships can broadcast fake returns to the Tempest. <laughs> The cat won't know which one is real. It will confuse their sensors and draw their ships off. It could buy you some time. I can work with that. Just enough to give us an advantage. The rest is up to you. I can handle it. Though it means going against the initiative. We're alone here. You didn't hear that. Hear what? We've been collating gamma charts all day. Lol. <laughs> They're all in their armor, and I'm in just my casual. This comes with the job, part of being a pathfinder. Sure, if they pay us once in a while. Not likely after this. You'll need to research the Ghost Storm technology first. Then we'll meet you at Meridian. Okay, we're not doing this yet. Good luck. Aha! I knew it. Horizontal gene transfer. The cat incorporate new DNA seamlessly into their own genome. I mean, all living beings are just a big buffet to steal from. Many species do the same. Only the most primitive do it by force. <laughs> wow. Okay, we're not doing this yet, so we're gonna put that on hold. Priority will be put on hold. <laughs> That's how I roll with this with mass with mass effect. I do the priority missions last. <laughs> that is such freaking that is such reverse logic right there. Reverse psychology. Let's go. Let's go to Aya first. And then we'll go back to that desert planet. Do as much as you can. And then stop, and then I probably won't play this until like Sunday. It's Friday right now. Ryder, could we talk a moment? Of course, hold on. Mm. Fine. I have to go back to the Nexus, dude. you are. I was wondering. Really? When you found the Solarian Ark, was anything strange? Out of place? You mean besides the exalted Krogan, the relics, and getting jabbed in the neck? Why are you asking? Because a few hours ago, we received this. Hello, Ryder. I don't think the Solarian Ark was captured by chance. If you want to know more, meet me at these coordinates. Crud. That's all. Do you think it's some sort of hoax? 
Now that I think about it, a Ket Armada just stumbling across the Solarian Arc seems a little convenient. Coincidences do happen, though when you put it like that... I'll put the coordinates for this meeting in the nav computer. I suppose there's no harm in making sure. Havari, huh? The heck? I thought I was supposed to go here. Alright, hold on. Let me exit first. Remnant runes. Oh my gosh, those are okay. These are kind of dumb because, yeah, I don't know, man. Uh, these tests seem like really just. <sighs> Whatever. What are these on EOS? Gosh damn. Going back to Havari. I just noticed their planet is a moon. Their home world is a freaking moon, pretty much. Or a dwarf planet just orbiting a gas giant. I haven't been here in a while. atmosphere LZ in sight uh, 
more of those dragon things. Oh, I don't need masks. Can I take off the mask? I took off the mask. Wow, it won't take out the mask. Had to go around the other side. Okay, this one was really bothering me. Go to main menu first.
Okay, cool. That's a lot of enemies. Three-way battle here. I keep on just want to kill as much enemies as I can, as fast as I can. Undocumented mineral nearby, Pathfinder. scattered around Avaro. We should pick up as many as we can find. Other side of this wall. I was just at the other side too. Make sure you can't go over it like that. Locked. I'll override it. Don't come any closer. Oh dear. We're here to help. Don't touch me. I just want to help. Your wounds, they're self-inflicted? They can't. I can't go back. 
I want to. <clears throat> Hush now, sister. The cat are dead. They can't take you. We won't let them. You sound like him. So confident. So sure. You mean Axel? He saved me. It gave me a chance to live. And die on my own terms. We need to find him, Thordia. Why is she dead? Ishare, brave one. I think she's dead. Even in the end, she was devoted to him. And Axul's using that devotion to spread hate. The only other person who could reach him is the Moshai. I was hoping to keep her out of this. She's always had a blind spot when it comes to Axul. Come on, let's go. Could just uh just do that. Totally forgot. <laughs> yeah, this map's kind of small, kind of, quote unquote, kind of. It's just small enough you don't need your nomad. coordinates we were sent. In the message about the Salarians? It's so late, so dude. So are we checking it out? Ambush. Dude, it's so late. What the heck? Dialogue is so late, dude. Okay. It's like so late. Okay. Like the no freaking subtitles are ahead. Let's look around. They might have left something.
From their gear, they were hoping to capture someone. Probably me. Sorry about that. Though, if you'd broken a sweat, I'd be sorrier. You sent us the message about the Salarian Ark? Yes. Major Salen Vaughn, STG. Retired, of course. Oh, wow. What's STG? Really? Special Tasks Group. Back home, we were field agents who gathered intelligence and handled inconveniences. Spies? <laughs> Assassins? Yep. If you prefer. As I said, these days I stick with retiree. A lot of people came to Andromeda for a fresh start. I'm sure I'll enjoy mine when I find it. Let's be frank. There are too many inconsistencies aboard our Ark. They only make sense if someone betrayed us to the Ket. My best suspect is a biologist, Dr. Adden. But the evidence is thin. I need a pathfinder to verify what I've found, or I risk arresting an innocent man. Who's Adam? Why would he betray his Ark? An ex-military biologist from the early wake-up team on our Ark. He claims to be studying the cat. As for why, I intend to ask him. Couldn't Reka help you solve this? I trust Reka implicitly, but I can't say the same for her team. You're obviously trustworthy. If you were involved, you wouldn't have saved our Ark in the first place. All right, I'm in. How do we catch your traitor? I only have two leads left. Dr. Adam's equipment and a cat who might be his handler. I need you and your Sam to analyze them. If we show Dr. Adam's in regular contact with a cat, that would prove he's the one. What's the standard punishment for cat collaborators? Most people would settle for an angry mom, but I <laughs> just as made the trip out here. Uh, remember Dr. Adam's equipment and his cat contact. This has to be watertight. Good luck. And bold to go all the way over there. I have to go to Vold now. This is, this is another wild goose chase. Holy crud! I have to speak with her. There's just a lot of side missions in this game. I'm I am kind of complaining about it because sometimes it just feels way overwhelming. What? There's still missions here? I didn't see any. Yeah, it's probably because it's probably those those ones that you you have to find stuff that are not on the map. It's probably those, dude. Kind of makes me mad. I'm not even gonna do that, dude. Uh, I would like to complete everything. Is this? If it doesn't show up on the map, you're just kind of wasting my time. <laughs> Steady. 
Approaching the LZ. For slushies, bad weather for it. Really, really, PB, really. <sighs> oh, okay, convenient. Yep, hashtag the resistance. <laughs> That's Techix, according to my map. Oh, has it melted yet? Is it in the... Oh, it is. The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. Really? Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Life support is back online. Water. Wait. I thought they were through it from in through the ice or water. I was like, what the heck? Why would you want to go on water in a freaking ice planet? This must be Dr. Adden's workspace. The one the STG agent is investigating. They could be leftovers from Adam's experiments. The agent mentioned a cat handler, too. Hmm. The windows are fogging up on the inside. Isn't there some sort of de icer? Defroster, you mean? That remnant site will have defenses. That self looks like a cat construct. Whoa. Oh my gosh, this game. If that STG agent was right, this cat was Dr. Adam's contact. Where are they? Jerk. I think they're all dead. I'm reading a temperature decrease. Let's get a scan. Speak to the person. Okay.
Oh, maybe I should just evac from there. Just go on the nomad. Nexus, huh, whatever. Survivors, great to see you. Hi, I'm Ken Garner, founder of the initiative. Welcome to the next question. Please leave. Ah, Ryder. Grab a seat. So, afterwards, the cat got twitchy. Took me a while to get back. The idea of Solarians figuring out exaltation must keep them up at night. Oh, I hope so. 
So you're finding out the cat's dirty exaltation secrets? That's the plan. Your star maps were helpful, by the way. You're welcome. Between us, charting the Scourge and Rider's Vault data, the cat will run out of bolt holes. I'll send you our latest. I'll take a copy as well. Anything to expand the search grid. Still hunting down the stasis pods. And finding them. Having a partner AI makes one hell of a difference. I guess I need to train a successor. And figure out how to prepare it. <laughs> Better to find your wings as you fly. Worked for us, didn't it? More groundwork would have helped in the early days. Huh. Well, that's worth knowing. Is this a, like a Pathfinder a AA meeting? To deal with. The first vintage bottled in Andromeda. Sent as a gift. Well, good thing I brought my flask. Really? Damn, that smells good. N Never mind Since about the AA meeting. Since we've got a moment to ourselves, shall we toast? To our crews, our Sams, and each other. And yeah, our Pathfinder. Pathfinders. Really? Wow, they just teleport everywhere. Oh my gosh. Ryder, always a pleasure. I hear you're assisting Major Salem Varn's investigation into Dr. Adam. You know Salem? I met him once or twice. A remarkable agent, despite his age. Unfortunately, my attempts to aid him have stalled. What do you make of Salem's theory that someone betrayed your people? It seems monstrous, but the more I consider it, the more the facts seem to fit. I've tried enlisting ARC leadership, those who woke first, but they've been busy, unhelpful, or both. Perhaps we should get... creative. Hey, if we don't break the rules, who will? One of the ARC officers who woke early, Rand Lawn, has an apartment here. Rand? If he's too busy to help, you could scan around, carefully, see what you can find. Sounds like our experience was a picnic compared to what the Solarians went through. Rake is determined to put an end to exaltation. She'll have every bullet I can lend her. There she go. Good luck, Sarissa. Thank you. I'll need it. Ah, Ryder, my hero. What? We Solarians have a tough road ahead. It's hard to wake up to such loss. But we are not the first, just one of many. Is there anything on your mind? What can you tell me about my father? He was a friend. And what he shared with me was shared in confidence. But I can tell you, the Alec Rider he showed to the world was but a sliver of the whole. He felt that to lead, he must project utter confidence. With me, he shared his fears and doubts, or at least a few of them. I considered that a great compliment. How are your people adjusting to life here? We are resilient. Our lifespan is short, so we have a built-in drive to maximize every minute. Many of us are getting to the business of bolstering our numbers and looking for opportunities to settle worlds. I have a few select teams looking into the cat. The better we know the enemy, the more prepared we'll be for whatever they throw at us next. How did you get involved with the initiative? My claim to fame in the Milky Way was that I found a way to restore the biodiversity of my homeworld. Huh. For decades, we knew that the planet would soon be unable to sustain us, so I was something of a hero. My work caught your father's attention, and he... How shall I say? Laid on the charm to enlist me for the initiative. Oh, yeah? Your father could be very charming when he wished. Interesting. What is it you strive for? For you, I mean. For me? All I've ever wanted is clarity. I devote much of my time looking in the mirror, trying to understand myself. Some might find it narcissistic, but in knowing myself, I can be true in the moment, with little self-interrogation. Ultimately, the motivation is to live a life free of regret. I have come close, thus far. Honestly, that does make sense, so... Is Captain Hager doing well? Hager is training to be my successor, if or when the need arises. Really? Wow. We lost so many of our leaders during our captivity. It's left several roles open to fill. Hager is a dedicated officer. The sky's the limit for him. He'd make a strong pathfinder. 
You're not thinking of skipping out on us, are you? Skipping out? Of course not. But life is a balancing act, and tipping points lurk around every corner. The better prepared he is, the smoother the transition. I should go. Nice talking with you, Rika. I am at your disposal, Ryder. We're like those specters, dude. But we're not like military people. We're... What the heck? Hi, Ryder. What are they doing here? They should be exploring. They should have ships. So official? Their own ships. Part of our little club? Club. It was the right call. Thanks for the push. Anytime. I love pushing people around. <laughs> so I hear. From who? Everyone. How have you been since HO47C? Fine, I'm fine. If you ever want to talk about Mason, you know where to find me. Thanks, Ryder. Really, I'm just not ready. I understand. Any luck finding other survivors from the Tannis? We brought in another batch yesterday. Still too many unaccounted for, but we're getting there. I'll keep an eye out. Thanks, Ryder. Appreciate Great. it. Great. It's a task. How's life on the Nexus treating you? Running water and rations. It's a beautiful thing. I can tell people are still shook up from the uprising, but compared to Avaro, things almost feel normal. Dang, he doesn't have that much to say. So, how are you finding the new post? Not used to having people question my actions, but I like the challenge more than I thought I would. Any regrets? Well, my only regret is that Mason isn't here to see me play diplomat with Tam. Back in the Milky Way, I would have punched sense into that worm. Now, <laughs> I use my words. I'm a changed man. Pathfinder versus Spectre. How does it compare? <laughs> They're completely different beasts. As a Spectre, I worked in the shadows. Intel was on a need-to-know basis. Here, everyone's looking at me. Looking to me. It's all out in the open. Which do you prefer? Being a Spectre was easier, but being a Pathfinder is more rewarding. Uh, I get that. Good seeing you, Avidus. Stay safe out there. Did someone fix that? And that? What? Yes, someone wants to talk. I saw blue. I don't know, I'm confused. Alright, let's go back to, to Tempest.
Hello. Okay, that's it for me. Whew. And I uh, will be back probably Sunday to play this, and then I'll be busy with school. Okay, thanks for watching. God bless. Freedom.